Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna to be I put Carmelo Hayes in the WWE Championship division. So this should be fun. We're on SmackDown, obviously. So no raw. So we're gonna go on SmackDown. This is the last show before Backlash. Carmelo Hayes. I put him in the accidentally put him in the WWE title division, but okay, that's gonna work anyways. So here we go. Let's see if he's booked, and he is against Santos Escobar, and obviously he wins his debut. Of the calendar year, Melo did not miss. Let's see what he can get at Backlash. Let's see what could happen. Otis is main eventing. Okay, that's kind of a W, though. Uh, LA Knight is going to face Roman Reigns. And LA Knight is a new WWE champion. Okay, that's sick. So now we're on the road to Night of Champions, which is not that long of a build. Let's see if he's on this SmackDown right here. He is against Joe Gacy, another NXT guy. And he is so far 2-0. And this one right here. So he's building up. So let's see what happens here before the, the end. The last uh, show before Night of Champions. He's facing Cameron Grimes. All these uh, NXT guys. And he's so far 3 0. Oh, building up a great name for himself. Uh, as we're here on Night of Champions, let's see who is on the PLE. Uh, let's see. Ooh, AJ Styles and LA Knight. Ooh, that would be so cool. Ray vs. Raquel already, but nothing else. So let's see, LA Knight retained his title. Sick. So let's go to the last SmackDown of May. <clears throat> Raw last night was pretty cool. LA Knight versus Carmelo Hayes. He's facing the WWE Champion. Obviously, he's not going to win that one, sadly. Uh, but LA Knight beats him. So now we're on June now. I'm hoping he's feuding with him. That's, that's just, I can only hope for that. Hopefully, he's feuding with him. So that, oh. We're just gonna see Carmelo Hayes, Grayson Waller, another NXT guy, but this time he takes the L. Or another former NXT guy. Where well, everyone here is a former NXT guy. I'm talking about recent NXT guys. Yeah, you know what I mean. So let's see. What the heck? I was about to say, like, why is there, like, okay, whatever. Carmelo Hayes versus LA Knight. This is, uh, a few, this is, he's fighting the, the champion. He's not winning, but still, he might actually win at Money in the Bank. Maybe if they can get a match there. That's the, that's the thing. He has to get a match there in order to be booked there. Uh, Carmelo Hayes, LA Knight again. Carmelo Hayes loses this time. He went from 3-0 and to 3-4. and That's not good. That's not ideal. Last, uh, SmackDown of June. This is not the SmackDown before Money in the Bank. This is just the last one of June. Roman Reigns, obviously, main eventing. Uh, Carmelo is facing Santos, the guy who he got his first win against, I think. And he's gonna get back on the winning streak. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're on the last show till Money in the Bank. Why is LA Knight and Roman Reigns teaming with each other? What the heck? Asuka's main eventing, sick. He's facing Santos again. This, he still gets the win, so back up on that winning streak. This is like the 2019 Dallas Cowboys. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Here we go. Money in the Bank, is he in the ladder match or is he facing LA Knight? That's the big question. Uh, he is not in the freaking ladder match, which sucks. I'm hoping he got a title shot. Wow. Um, so, LA Knight was not even on the show. So, let's see what happens afterwards. I'm surprised he wasn't even booked on there. Maybe they're saving that view for SummerSlam? I have no idea. But, um, yeah. He's facing Bray Wyatt. And Bray Wyatt obviously wins. But they're going to start feuding until SummerSlam. So, that sucks. Okay, so <laughs> we're going to get past SummerSlam like that. Let's see what happens. We're on July now. He's facing Butch or Pete Dunne. Uh, he's going to get he's gonna get a win there. So here's July week four. Let's see what he can get. Karrion Cross made event, but he's facing Bray Wyatt once again. Bray Wyatt will get the win, so... I'm just going to skip to SummerSlam. Yeah, you know what? No, it's one show. It's fine. But Carmelo Hayes will be getting a spot in the biggest party of the summer. So, that's uh, a good thing. AJ Styles main eventing. Carmelo's still facing Bray. He loses to Bray again. Maybe Carmelo can get that big win at SummerSlam. You never know. You never know. Why is Apollo Crews facing Dom at SummerSlam? What the heck? But here's SummerSlam right here. Uh, that Yeah, they're just for the IC title. Bray Wyatt versus... Um, uh, Carmelo Hayes is set. Let's see what happens here. And Bray Wyatt just slaughters him. Sadly, there goes Carmelo Hayes' big party of the summer there. And now we're back onto the SmackDown scene. Let's, uh, we're on the road to payback now. So let's see how this one will go. Um, 
He's facing the champion LA Knight in a rivalry. Yes, it's in a rivalry. He lost, but it's in a rivalry. So maybe he could get the championship at payback. That could be an awesome show. That could be a good one. That could be a good one for Carmella. Is he facing him again? Yes, he is. Does he get a win? Yes, he does. He's 7-9 and nine now. Not really a good record, but I'm happy he's already feeding with a champion this early on in this uh, uh, simulation. So let's see how this one goes right here. Scarlet's many, many once again. As Drew Gulak is facing him, I don't see... I don't see him on here. LA Knight's facing Drew Gulak. Of course he wins. Why is that a rivalry? Imagine he gets a title shot in that LA Knight. But here we go. Week uh, September 1st of... Uh, this is the last show before payback. Damn. What a match there. Uh, and LA Knight, Carmelo Hayes right here. No contest. So, yeah. It's exactly what you want to see on the night before payback. Let's go. Carmelo Hayes win the title. Let's go. Let's do this. The WWE Championship and Carmelo loses. Ouch. His first title shot and he loses that match. That really sucks. He got his first title shot, and that sucks. He's 7-10-1 right now. That sucks. Now he's going to go to the back of the line. He needs to get some a bunch of wins. He's facing Wolfgang, which is not hard to beat. Why is that in a rivalry? This should be on NXT. <laughs> uh, I don't know who LA Knight's... Oh, is Carmelo feeding with Bobby? That might be a cool feud for him. Oh, no. He's facing LA Knight, but I think Bobby costed him. I want to see this. Hold on. I think Bobby costed him. Yeah, yeah, Bobby cost him the match. Damn it, dude. So now that's going to be a fast lane match. He was facing LA Knight, too. Not for the title, but still, he was facing LA Knight. I thought that would con be continued. Lashley gets the win. Carmelo is kind of at a standstill at this point. Was LA Knight defending the title alone? No, nah, he, he was facing Roman Reigns. Damn. Whoops. Uh, here we go. Final show before fast lane, which, dang it, dude. Had him right there. October 1st, he's facing uh, Lashley, but he got the win this time. Hopefully, he can get the win on, at Fastlane. He got he has his momentum, so hopefully, he can get the win here. Um, I, don't, I think LA Knight's actually facing Roman for the title, so let's see about that. Lashley, Carmelo, and Carmelo ends the feud with the win. Thank goodness. Uh, no, we did not have a WWE Championship on the show. LA Knight, defend the title, please. Okay, so now we're going to head to Survivor Series. One of the big four PLEs. Let's see. Oh, he's facing Julius Creed. And he went. Why is this a rivalry match? This doesn't need to be. He's facing Bray Wyatt, though. Hmm. So it's very interesting right here. Very, very interesting. Carmelo Hayes and R-Truth. And why is Bray Wyatt in the main event? Did he win Money in the Bank? Damn, that's crazy. Carmelo Hayes, R-Truth. And R-Truth gets the win because I think Bray Wyatt might have costed him. Roman Reigns beat the champions, so I'm guessing he's getting a title shot in Survivor Series. Uh, week 4 of October, last uh, one for October. So I think he's facing someone else. He's not even on the card. Interesting. Logan Paul got the win against Bray, though, so I'm thinking Carmelo costed him. So far, Carmelo is 11-13 in this simulation, so not that good so far. And Bray Wyatt gets the win, 11 and 14 for Carmelo now. That sucks. Oh, Roman Reigns, LA Knight. Uh, no contest for these two. But for the title, LA Knight retains. I feel like he's going to, like, I feel like Carmelo should beat him after Survivor Series. But I don't know at this point. Do rivalries finish on regular shows? That's what I'm wondering. Bray Wyatt keeps beating Carmelo Hayes. Like, come on. Come on, Melo. Come on. 11 and 15 is not good. Please, Carmelo. Come on. Get the win here. Carmelo Hayes, Ridge Holland. That's easy. It's Ridge Holland. Get the win. W. And here we go. Survivor Series War Games. This is the last of the big four. Dakota Kai main eventing is something you love to see. Judgment Day versus literally all of Alpha Academy and Gunther. <laughs> that would be crazy. Here we go. Bray Wyatt, Carmelo Hayes, and Bray Wyatt gets the win at the PLE. Damn it, dude. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Uh, no freaking uh, championship defended by LA Knight, so that sucks. So here we go. We're on December now. So hopefully he can go undefeated, and then in January he can get the Royal Rumble shot. 
Uh, oh, he's in a triple threat, but Bobby Lashley got the win, damn it. I feel like he might be feuding with him now. I mean, he's had a lot of good feuds, but right now I think I, he, I need him to get the championship at the Royal Rumble. Another big four PLE. Ray Wyatt's made event, and Carmelo hit LA Knight, let's go! And LA Knight gets the win, but there's no rivalry, so no good comes out of it. I don't see any rivalries developing with him in LA Knight, so damn it. Hopefully he could be initiated this week. Karen Cross is made eventing. He's facing AJ. That may be a good feud. But he's losing. He's racking up loss after loss after loss. This is not good right now. I need him to get back into the win column. He's 12 and 19 right now. He started off really well, and now he fell off. What happened? He's facing Sheamus? Come on, Carmelo. Come on! Why is he losing this much? December is not his month. Oh, my goodness. He, hopefully, he can win the Rumble and have a good turnaround. But he's facing freaking Sheamus, and he's going to face him at the Rumble. Sucks. Come on, Melo. Please win. Come on, dude. At least win at the Rumble. His last win was against, was against Ridge freaking Holland. Bruh. He's facing a Logan Paul, which is the... I think he's a U.S. champion. No, it's Rey Mysterio. I have no idea. Carmelo... Or Logan beats him, so... Uh, I don't know anymore. We're in January. He has this awful losing streak. This is not good at all. He's facing Brutus Creed. And he get, finally snaps that losing streak, doesn't he? It's a good thing. So here we go. Last show before the Royal Rumble. I doubt that he's going to win the Rumble now since he's feuding with freaking Sheamus out of all people. I mean, no disrespect to Sheamus, but come on. I don't need him getting into any feuds before the Rumble. I don't even think he was booked. No, he was not. Lashley pinned the champion, so now I'm thinking they're going to fight at the Rumble. Here we go, Royal Rumble. Hopefully Carmelo can win the Rumble as well. Uh, but I doubt it, since he's facing Sheamus for some reason. Dom and Julius, I mean, Dom and Apollo Crews have been fighting for like the past month or so. <laughs> Sheamus versus Melo, no WWE Championship at all. Carmelo Hayes wins the feud against Sheamus, and the Royal Rumble winner was won by Julius Creed. Oh my gosh. Now we're on the belt to the Elimination Chamber. He's 14-22, and 22, so hopefully if he can get a win here, he can probably qualify for the Elimination Chamber. That's what I'm hoping. Ellen and Ray Mysterio, damn it. Title for title. Lashley Hayes, yes. And Hayes got the win. So I'm thinking he might be in the Elimination Chamber now. Hopefully. Ellen Knight's facing Robert Roode at the Elimination Chamber, so I'm not, I'm not excited for that. Biggie's main event in W. Special guest ref, Julius Creed, the Royal Rumble winner. Oh, he chose LA Knight. Damn. Randy Orton's going to face Carmelo Hayes. And Randy gets the win. Damn, dude. He's going to he's gonna face freaking LA Knight at WrestleMania. He is. No, Robert Roode. I'm talking about Julius Creed. Damn, I forgot about that. AJ and Carmelo. Why is this a rivalry? Come on. I don't need this happening right now. Come on, please be in the chamber. Hopefully he is. He's not feuding with AJ right No. Please be in the chamber, though. And he is not. Damn, dude. He's not going to have any title. LNI versus Robert Roode, though. Where is... I don't even think Melo's on, on the show. LNI, Robert Roode, and LNI retains. Okay. Now we're heading into the last show from February. This is not good at all. Melo is just missing. 15 and 24 is not a good record. Hopefully, he can start racking up a lot more wins now. Carmelo Hayes is in this fatal four way. Hopefully, no more contenders. And he lost to Randy Orton. Okay. Dang it. We're in March now. LA, uh, Carmelo Hayes started the first half of the year really well. The second half, he really fell off. Facing Randy. I feel like he's going to face Randy at WrestleMania at this point. Randy gets another win against him. I'm guessing Melo just had to put people over. He doesn't like it. We are we already have a month left. It's it might be over now. Roman Reigns and LA Knight for the title on a random SmackDown. LA Knight retains, obviously. LA Knight's been holding the title since like SummerSlam, right? The money bank. Even before that, I think. I have no idea. It's about time he drops it. The LA Knight fights wise, I don't know. What a triple threat, and Carmelo gets the win. W. Let's go, Melo. Let's go, Melo. Now, here you go. Final uh, SmackDown in March. And, and he beats the WWE Champion? Oh, okay. Okay, that's fun there. All right, we'll see. Maybe he can get a title shot in this month of SmackDown. Maybe not WrestleMania, because I know Julius Creed's there. 
Uh, but maybe, maybe, maybe he pinned the champion. There's got to be something there. And he's not booked. Okay. Let me just check. Carmelo Hayes is actually... Oh, he actually won a tag match. I didn't even notice that. With Uncle Howdy. <laughs> oh, gosh. That's crazy. <laughs> but there we go. The last SmackDown before WrestleMania. The WrestleMania SmackDown. And is he on the show? No, he's not. Ouch. And here's WrestleMania. The big, the showcase of the Immortals. Here we go. Chelsea Green's made defending WrestleMania. Good W, though. Uh, I don't see him here. Four weeks on exactly for the title, though. Actually, be pretty sick. Julius Green, LA Knight, and... Uh, he was out the first. Julius Creed won the WWE Championship. Let's see if he can defend the title right now against Melo and and lose. Imagine that happens. Jimmy's main eventing. Julius is facing Bray Wyatt. So I completely doubt anything right here. Hopefully Melo gets a win. No, he does not even do that either. Dang it! And now we move on to the last night of the calendar year. It's it's over at this point. So here we go. Week four cross main eventing. We can only, no, he's not. Yeah, he's not. He's not. Damn it, it's over. It's over. Carrying Cross, Rey Mysterio. He wasn't even booked, and that's going to do it for the video. That sucks. That really does. Dang it, he had a really good first half of the year, and then he fell off. That's going to be it for this one. Thank you for watching, and have a